Hello, welcome to Smart Tool. Today we're going to be calibrating the Digital Protractor Pro 3600. It is accurate to within plus or minus 0.05 degrees. To begin calibration, turn the unit on. You don't need a perfectly level surface, as you can see from the image. You're going to press and the hold button and the alt zero switch simultaneously. The display should read SUP for superset. Then you'll see a zero inside flashing brackets. That tells you that the unit is now ready to begin calibration. So without moving the unit, now press just the hold button one time and you'll see the zero changes to a one the brackets are still flashing that's telling you that you're still in superset mode now like the old child's game spin the bottle you're going to spin it away from you now you can't see the display from that angle but i'm going to press the hold button and the display changes to a two inside flashing brackets that tells you you have completed the second step now flip it over onto its top or the 180 degree position allow it a few seconds to stabilize it's a liquid filled sensor so it needs some few moments to stable now press the hold button. You'll note that the number changes to three inside flashing brackets. And again, we're gonna play the old child's game, spin the bottle. We're going to rotate it end for end. And again, you cannot see the display from that angle, but I'm going to press the hold button and the display changes to a four inside flashing brackets. Now that has completed the vertical calibration. Now we're ready to calibrate the horizontal. It's best to have a known 90 degree surface against which to calibrate it. Press, give it a few moments to stabilize. Press the hold button and observe that the display changes to a five inside flashing brackets. Now, instead of playing the old child's game, spin the bottle, imagine you have a can of, I don't know, Coca-Cola sitting on your desk and you want to rotate that can without lifting it so that you can see the back label. Now you can't see it from that angle, but I'm going to press, I'm going to give it a few moments to stabilize, and I'm going to press the hold button. The display changes to a six inside flashing brackets. Now I'm going to flip it end for end so that what was up is now down, what was down is now up. Again, I'm gonna give it a few moments to stabilize. Then I'm going to press the hold button and observe the number changes to a seven inside flashing brackets. Now again, I'm going to rotate my, um, for argument's sake, my can of Coca-Cola so I can read the back label. I'm going to give it a few moments to stabilize, then I'm going to press the hold button. The display changes to an 8, followed immediately by 90 degrees, or very, very close to it. Let's put it here so you can see it. 90 degrees. I'm budgeting it, bumping it a little bit. 90 degrees. We'll set it flat. This surface might not be perfectly flat. 
and we're going to rotate it here. This is more closely the approximates the way we normally use it. We're not using a perfectly level surface, so of course you're not going to see it read 0.00, .00 but had we taken the time to level this table, it would. And that's all there is to calibration of the Pro 3600 from MD Building Products.